Dr. Mohamed Abdikuti, a medical doctor by profession and a renowned politician, born and grown up in Isolo, who understands very well the dynamics of Isolo people and politics, now sits at the apex of Isolo County leadership, Isolo County Governor. So help me God. Having been politically now elected four times in different political positions, as his political signature that he is recognized by, Yoya, which means peace. Yoya means come together. And therefore, I made this running call, and this running call really became the brand of my politics. And uh, right now, if you say Yoya in Isolo, that's my other name. In fact, people may, most people may not even know Mohammed Abdikuti. All they see when I pass is Yoya. How his political journey has been successful is through his continued and campaigns and vast understanding of the people's tastes in politics. We make sure that uh, we involve everybody and uh, uh, I always say Yoya, Kulinga, Kupima na Kupata. Kulinga means you, you assess the political situation, you bring everybody on, on board, uh, Kupima is to bring the various individuals within the community who also have influence. You don't just pick every partner because uh, politics in Isolo and even in Kenya is ethnic based. So you must make sure that you get influential people among the communities to stand by you. And obviously then is Kupata, which means your success is based on, on that. But mainly it's because of uh, the issue of harmony, the, 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 the trust I built among the people. Uh, everybody feels they are safe with Kuti. Everybody feels their rights will be protected better, better by Kuti. Dr. Kuti is really conversant with the people's dynamics. That is why he has managed to successfully hold member of Isolo North parliamentary seat for two successive terms, before going up political randa in 2013 and successively vying for senatorial seat and in 2017 gubernatorial seat. I fully understand the dynamics of Isolo politics. Isolo is a cosmopolitan community. As I said, there are five major tribes and uh, there are other smaller tribes, so-called minority. And I try to make sure that all of them are brought on board in terms of not just campaigning, but even after campaigning to ensure that at least uh, each community feels they are part of the leadership by having their sons employed here than there. If there are contracts, they also benefit. If there are opportunities, if there are consultations, they are also brought on board. We have formed Council of Elders. I have helped form Council of Elders of these major tribes, and I bring all of them on board, and I bring them together, and make sure that they also live peacefully. And my agenda is peace. Now away from politics, Governor Dr. Kuti, being a medical doctor, holds the health sector in Isolo County, and that is his call agenda to improve health sector by all means. I'm a doctor, and uh, we kept saying my deputy is also a doctor. We are a team of doctors, and health, therefore, is our very prime uh, priority to revive because the health uh, sector is collapsed, uh, and we are starting to revive the health sector. We want to start by the very uh, last mile of health delivery, and that is community health. So I want to make sure that the community health department and the community health service in this country, in this county, is going to be benchmarked by other counties. And in that motive, the county is up to the task of even uplifting the fees of Isolo Level 5 hospital and even installing vital infrastructure in it. This is a hospital built in 1986 through the British support and it was a fantastic hospital but now the infrastructure is falling apart, uh, the softwares are not there. So we are number one ensuring that the hospital is having a facelift. We are putting only this year we are putting 80 million shillings to make sure it has a facelift. We have just put in a brand new oxygen plant. We used to get oxygen from uh, Meru or we get oxygen from Nairobi and sometimes because of these distances patients who need urgent oxygen and they are uh, in critical condition and they need oxygen they don't get oxygen because of the distance now we have overcome that we have 
our own oxygen plant manufacturing oxygen on site at the hospital and it is piped to every bed. Also, we have ensured that our X-ray department is fully functional and uh, X-ray films are always available. The pharmacy is fully stocked all the time. And in that motive, the county is up to the task of even uplifting the fees of Isolo Level 5 hospital and even installing vital infrastructure in it. Apart from health, his heart is also tied around early childhood education where in a bin to improve and strengthen the foundation of education for Isolo children. Isolo has partnered with UNICEF in order to improve and manage the ECDE centers in Isolo County. In education, for example, ECD is the mandate of the counties. That is early childhood development, uh, early childhood education. And the, here we have also partnered with UNICEF and through this partnership we have revived our ECD centers. Happy.